Douglas of close range. Second time lucky, Luke Douglas. There he goes, Douglas. He goes himself. And cool hand, Luke. Scores next to the post for the Gold Coast Titans. I approached the Titans, they received a presentation from me, um, I talked about Down Syndrome, I took Sarah along and introduced her, but it was Luke who took the move to say yes, this is a group I want to work with. Hello, how's it going? Luke, do you remember Luke? I'm Luke. I remember you, Sarah. How are you going? Luke's mum, who sadly now passed away, she had been a teacher's aide and worked with children with disability and he'd always been brought up with an understanding of inclusion. So he selected us and the relationship with the whole club has grown from there. But without Luke's support, we would have achieved none of this. He's incredible. Welcome to music today, everyone. We get down here at Eleanor State School and, you know, they got a special class that um, we get in and, and uh, play a bit of music, sing songs, uh, play instruments and um, get some really active and involved and, and they learn stuff too, like we did a lot of shapes and animals and sounds and yeah we get down here and they, they loved it and uh, we enjoyed it too. The Gold Coast Titans, their match day charity is the Down Syndrome Association, so to Luke Douglas well done. He's very passionate about giving the children, all children, an opportunity to participate and succeed. And he's very respectful, very caring. I mean, I know today he'd quite like to get down and rough and tumble with them. I am involved in um, a junior league team. I coach the under-13s, and um, that's pretty cool. I'm trying to help the, the young footballers um, evolve, I suppose. They obviously love it, you know, the insight that um, that they get into not only, you know, Luke's expertise, but they, they get an insight into, into what an NRL player does, you know, so he brings things not only from a coaching perspective, but also as a player perspective from the NRL and they, they sort of thrive on, on, you know, those little things that they do. They're, they're heroes in the, in the game uh, down here at the Bears. I think Dougie's wedding was a, a true indication of where people hold him, um, you know, in regards to the type of person he is. He asked if they could donate to a foundation um, in his mother's memory. His mum was so helpful to so many young kids uh, when he was growing up, uh, Luke, and now he wants to do that already. It just shows what sort of person he is. He made a very big and brave decision to embrace us and to create these opportunities and he is just so genuine in his commitment. There's no kind of shallowness, in fact he even talks about opportunities to engage with the children when there are no cameras around. He said, I should come more often, you know, we should do this again really soon and we, you know, he does, he doesn't publicise it, he doesn't talk about it, he just quietly gets on and does it. He is the most deserving case.